So why use rabbits as the proxy humans in an allegorical story about the demonization of the minority other? Well, comedy and satire is a great way of asking very serious questions in, in a way that doesn't seem that serious at all, sort of flying under the radar. So in, on one level, I'm looking at the cruelty and indifference with which one human group treats another human group. But on another level, I'm also sort of looking at the confusing relationship that humans have with the other animals on the planet. And, and this is, I think, none better typified than our relationship with rabbits. Because when we like them, we, we really like them. And we have them as pets. We not think to be cruel to them. All over pop culture, then TV, um, television, um, advertising, everywhere. And we use words to describe them like cute and cuddly and fluffy and adorable. But when we don't like them, we use other words. We use vermin and a plague and a pest, and they have to be destroyed in their hundreds of millions, in the most barbaric way you could imagine, I mean, even, even as far as uh, bacteriological warfare. So I think as we move into the Anthropocene and um, a major extinction event, which is, yes, to do with us, I think it's a question that, um, that needs to be asked as well, under the radar, with a bit of satire and comedy. But rabbits, I think, were the perfect choice.